hi friends welcome you to my youtube channel smart study point friends in this video i will tell you about theorem 10.6 of class 9 ncert book of chapter circle so friend let's see what is theorem 10.6 theorem 10.6 is that equal cos of a circle are equidistant from the center so friend in this video i will tell you how to prove this theorem easily so friends i have done the figure here and i have written here so let's move to the proving so we are given here that a b chord is equal to c d chord this chord is equal to this chord and we have to prove that the per the distance between these two chords from the center are equal friends we know that the distance is always measured through a perpendicular so the distance from from a point to any line is the perpendicular distance because perpendicular distance is the shortest distance between the cent between a point and a line so oe is the distance between the center o and ab and of is the distance between center o and cd so let's move to the proving so given is ab equal to cd and to prove we have to prove that this distance oe is equal to of so here we need a construction that is join ob radius and join cd radius so let's move to the proving so now in proof i can write that ab is equal to cd it is given here ab equal to cd and now i can write that half of ab is equal to half of cd and now half of ab i can write eb and half of cd i can write fd eb is equal to fd friends we are thinking that how i can write that half of ab is eb and half of cd is fd friends because in one in the previous theorems we have read that the perpendicular from the center bisect the chord so here i will write the reason that perpendicular from the center bisect the chord so friends perpendicular from the center bisect the chord so this eb is equal to fd and now i will take congruency condition to make these two equal and now i will write here in triangle eob and triangle f o d we got that e b is equal to o f sorry e b is equal to f d reason reason i will write here that proved above as i have proved it above so i write here proved above e b equal to f d and now i can write here that OB is equal to OD friends because OB and OD as the radius of the same circles so i will write here radi of same circle and now friends we have got two condition and we need another one condition to prove this theorem and now this is as these two are perpendiculars so o e b and o f d the degree is 90 degree so i can write here that o e b is equal to o f d is equal to 90 degree as this is the perpendicular so o e b is equal to o f d is equal to 90 degree therefore triangle e o b is congruent to triangle F O D by R H S congruency condition. So by right angle hypotenuse and any one side, I have proved these two triangles, triangle E O B and F O D congruent. So by corresponding parts of congruent triangles, I can write that O E equal to O F. So O E is equal to O F by C P C T. 
हेंस प्रूव्ड सो फ्रेंड्स आई हैव प्रूव दिस थ्योरम 10.6 इक्वल कॉर्ड्स ऑफ सर्कल आर इक्वल डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम द सेंटर सो फ्रेंड्स आई होप दैट यू अंडरस्टूड दिस थ्योरम प्रॉपर्ली एंड इफ यू अंडरस्टूड दिस थ्योरम प्रॉपर्ली प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड कमेंट ऑन माय वीडियो एंड प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल सो दैट आई कैन ब्रिंग मोर एंड मोर रिलेटेड टू दिस मैथमेटिक्स साइंस एंड एवरीथिंग व्हिच आर रिलेटेड टू योर स्टडीज ओनली सो फ्रेंड्स थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग